In this demonstration, I'll show you how to install the MCBK 36A as well as connect it to the iSmart TFT. The first step is to visit itronTFT.com and go to the SD NAND, EEPROM and USB section. On this page, you will find all the information about the USB interface adapter, the MCBK 36A, as well as be able to download the datasheet and driver files for installation. There is also a picture of ways to connect the MCBK 36A to the iSmart TFT. You will then need to download the driver for your operating system by clicking the appropriate link. You will then be asked for your details before proceeding. Then you will need to click on this link where you have the option to save or open the zip file. I suggest opening and then extracting the file from the zip file into your directory of choice. The next stage is to connect the MCBK 36A to the iSmart TFT. Two ways that this is possible are to directly solder the MCBK 36A to the connector 3 on the iSmart TFT with the two square solder pads which are pin 1 connected to each other or by using a ribbon cable. When the USB is connected for the first time, the computer will ask for the MCBK 36A to be installed. You may need administrator rights to do this. You will then need to use the hardware wizard and select No, not this time. Then click on Next. Then you will need to click on Install from specific location and then select Next. On the next page you need to change the directory location to where you unzip the driver file to. Then click on next. A pop-up will appear. You then need to select continue anyway. The process will then complete and the MCBK 36A will be saved as a COM port. You will then be able to send data to the NAND and RAM via the MCBK 36A through the iDev TFT. When using iDev TFT to send data to the NAND and RAM you will need to use this code and put this in your TU file. This can be found with the MCBK 36A driver at oitrontft.com